getting your emails marked as transactional within Klaviyo is something that can absolutely crank your deliverability up across your entire account and believe it or not, drive some serious sales. My name is Gavin. I run an email and SMS marketing agency. We've managed over 120 clients at this point, driven about $5.8 million in revenue for e-commerce brands and B2B businesses across pretty much every industry. So I absolutely know what I'm talking about. Let's get into it. So transactional emails are emails that are simply updating a customer about a status relating to either their order or their account or anything that can relate to, for example, refunds, canceled orders, which once again relates to orders. Transactional emails within Klaviyo, if you get them marked as transactional, result in higher click rates and get treated in open rates and get treated with higher priority within people's uh, email accounts. So you know within Gmail, like if I were to open my Gmail account, you can see here that I've got primary, promotions, social, and updates right here, right? Emails that get marked as transactional are more likely to land in the updates folder or the primary folder, which means the email is more likely to get seen and which also means you have a better opportunity at selling and you also have the opportunity to bring the deliverability up for all your other emails, right? Because deliverability is reliant on opens, clicks, engagements. The emails that are marked as transactional that get higher engagement bring the deliverability for your overall account up, which just improves where your emails are landing in general. So getting marked emails uh, or getting emails rather marked as transactional. This is how you do it. Within your email marketing, you click the email within your flow because transactional emails are always going to be uh, related to, for example, an order being fulfilled, a refund status being at, uh, updated. You're going to click into your flow and notice here at the bottom where it says UTM tracking transactional email and then we have an A-B test. If it doesn't have this tag on it, it's not going to be transactional. And pretty much every email in your account is not originally going to be marked as transactional. This is how you fix that. So you get an email. The email itself, I'm not going to show you the actual email design because this client wants to remain confidential, but the email itself has to be 80% informational. So updating the individual about their orders, how to track it, and then the remaining 20% you can have pretty much whatever you want in there as long as it's not relating to the use of coupon codes and sales, okay? Because when you add coupon codes and sale announcements or anything heavily, heavily marketing, that's gonna prevent it from being marked as transactional. But you can actually add 20% of the email and make that remaining 20% pushing people to your website. So a really cool trick that I've done is taken these emails, made them 80%, uh, transactional and the bottom 20% being like explore the rest of our products or learn more about this collection and that kind of stuff and that helps drive a bit more traffic to the website now what you can do to get it marked as transactional you actually have to contact Klaviyo support so click the email and then you're gonna click edit email or rather just over here you're gonna click right hand side where it says edit click edit I've just shortened the screen here to keep these guys anonymous. Copy the link. So click copy. Go up to the left hand corner where it says Clavio up there and then click up here. Click support. And my beautiful face is now moved up to the right hand corner, but then go email support. Go category, other, selection, question about something else submit request and then go ahead and say hi I would like the following email to be marked as transactional boom copy and paste the link send that over to them give it high priority and then hit submit and then they'll get back to you and let you know if your email has been marked as transactional. This is something that no one really does that you absolutely should. It's going to improve the deliverability of your account, really power up your email marketing, and hopefully help you get some more sales across the line. If you guys have any questions about this stuff, please let me know. And then also, if you want a free guide on how to improve your post-purchase thank you flows or it might be a few other flows. I'm not 100% sure on what's in this document, but uh, go ahead and click the link down below and I'll give you a free outline to some key automations that you need in your e-commerce business. Thanks for watching.